Yeah, I highly doubt that. You've literally been unable... You have literally been unable to destroy any of the generals. At all. I highly doubt that AI Dion is destroyed. Yeah, too bad you guys will never get anywhere near it. Because you're women. Nah, they're not going to let women join. Feel filthy up. The boy time. Like, seriously. How many power-ups have R1 and R2 gotten? And new mechas. And this new combo that's exclusive to them. And the ladies have literally gotten nothing. Granted, the commander hasn't gotten anything, but he's had major story beats on his side. The ladies? When was the last time they had a story? This was the biggest problem with Toku. Ladies just exist as extra space fillers. Interesting. All of their various rescue vehicles are based on actual rescue and construction vehicles, even the giant wind turbine. Not sure what the wind turbine is used for, but it's clearly a construction vehicle. And for anyone who doesn't know why um, fire trucks have those little struts on the side, it's to keep it from uh, moving. It's a very simple thing. They're literally there to keep it from moving. Because you don't want your fire truck to be rolling even a little bit. So, as I said, the three generals were not killed. They're introducing a new replacement for Dine, his daughter, for some reason, whatever. And I'll bet you that the Diane AI is still alive somehow. Because if there's one thing that Rescue Force has told us, is they're absolutely terrible at taking out anything above a minion. Like, they couldn't even take out the human Dion. They call him the Demorph, but that's it. Talk about here, Rescue Force, everybody. And that's it. Here on uh, Bandex Friday.